again, Tony from Little Kids Rock. Now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the bass and the role that the bass plays within uh, Cumbia and specifically in this song, Vida de Rico. Uh, so one thing to note is the bass in Cumbia usually has a, a nice low and full tone to it. It is the backbone of the rhythm section. So we're going to go ahead and, and uh, play this part right here. Uh, now something to keep in mind is that Vida de Rico is in the key of G flat major. But for our purposes, we're going to go ahead and move it up a half step to G major. Okay, So I'm going to play G right here. And it's important to, to note that the cumbia bass line usually uh, outlines the chord. Okay, Whatever chord you're playing, uh, that's what you're going you're gonna to outline. So we're usually playing the, the 1, the 3, and the 5 of any given chord. So for the G chord, I'm going to play a low G. Then I'm going to play B, or 2nd fret on the A string, and then D, or 5th fret on the A string. Okay, so we got G, B, and D. These are the only three notes that we're going to work with when playing the, uh, the G major chord. Okay, and the rhythm that we're going to play is, is going to go 1, 2, and 3, 4, and 1, 2, and 3, 4, and 1. Okay, so it's going to go like this. One, two and three, four and one, two and three, okay? And now we're gonna go ahead and do this uh, with with the music. So let's uh, let's have some fun with it. Here we go. One, two, one, two, ready, and. Right, so we're doing this uh, at the same tempo that Vida de Rico is at, which is at around 88 beats per minute. So go ahead and practice it this way. If it feels a bit uh, too fast for you, feel free to slow it down to a tempo that's, that's more uh, accessible for you, and then gradually start to, to build it up this way, okay? So with this G major chord, this is essentially the shape that we're going to be playing uh, for all the major chords, okay? Or anytime you come across a major chord, you're going to just play this type of shape right here, okay? Now, the second chord for Vida de Rico is an E minor. So now we're dealing with, with a minor shape, okay? Which is a little bit different, and it's going to go, uh, we're going to play it here on the seventh fret of the A string, okay? And now the third uh, of E, of the E minor chord, is a G, okay? And then the fifth is a B natural, okay? So we're going to go E, G, and B. And if you notice, the shape for, uh, for the minor chord is, is a bit different than, than the major shape, right? Okay? And then go ahead and, and do the exact same thing. We're going to go ahead and practice it. Uh, in rhythm, so that way you can you can see uh, how how that feels. Okay, one, two, one, two, ready and. basic way to go ahead and play a cumbia bass line. In the next video, we're going to go ahead and cover a few variations that you could potentially do uh, with the cumbia pattern. See you there.